What does Salvador Perez have in mind today for the praying mantis who I think needs a name. Although there's been a debate on Twitter between Joel and our associate producer Dave Holtzman over the gender of the praying mantis. He leads the Royals with three bunk base hits. That's amazing. He's only been here a very short time. Just he's just played in this is just his 12th game and he already leads him in hits. And there's Rowley. How about that for a fast acting sign. I like it. Someone went to work right away last night when they got home because they were probably as excited as the fans were leaving the ballpark last night. I, I loved it. I could feel the energy walking out of the building. It was so nice. I mean the fans were happy to see a win and they beat the Blue Jays and and little do they know that Raleigh had a big part of it. And when they got home they saw Raleigh. They're moving in. I see him. There he is. Or there she is. One of those two statements was correct. Go see John. There you go, John. It is not a shy praying mantis. We know that. No, he's very friendly. You're curious. Ryan Lefevre, Rex Sudler, with Joel Goldberg, Jeff Montgomery, and Rally. Rally. Which is exactly what the Royals have done the last two games with the praying mantis, which is a little more frightening when you really zoom in on it. That's one of them. Salvi's had the other one on his cap all day. Yeah, that's the original rally. You wonder if they're going to make that a pet and find a cage for it and feed it and take care of it and keep him around because if he can keep getting help to generate wins like that. They need them. They can get back to 500. That's what their goal. That's their goal. Swanee and Raleigh have kissed and made up, by the way. They're pals now. 